Jez, I just want a quick review on what you thought of War Room. I'm feeling jacked, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's filled with the Lord. Oh yeah. No, I'm seriously, I want to hear like a serious review. Like, don't stop mucking around and Sorry. be real. Look at these legends in the car tonight. We've got Jezebel, commonly known as Jeremy or Jem. Or Jezza. Or Jez. And Chicken, commonly known as Chicken. Chicken. <laughs> His real name's Jamie. But when we actually call him Jamie, it's probably the weirdest thing in the world. True. He likes being called Jamie, though. We're about to go see a movie that starts in about one minute all other movie goers would be there in a minute's time and we're about 25 minutes away so hopefully we'll just make it after the movie starts and that's what chicken and jays think about that in the car, mate. we've also got sorry we've also got lissy lou please aka Drug dealers. aka mummy Jez, seriously dude, keep it down, eh? Sorry, man. Well, I'll be quiet now. No, seriously, can you please just keep it a bit further down? Sorry, guys, I've just had a rough week. Tell us about it. What's been happening? Why has it been so bad? Well, yesterday, Mum made me dinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's really rough. Well, no, but I wanted to make my own dinner, so I didn't eat hers. I fed it to Dad. What did she make? There's like vegetables and stuff. So I cooked up some ham and cheese ravioli. It was handmade from all these. Ham and cheese ravioli. Yeah, but yeah, it was good. Did you say ham, mate? But then mum was really upset. Ham like, made oh, ham. Jam. Jam. Oh, Jam, I made like you dinner. <laughs> so mum's oh, a bit Jimmy upset with me at the Jimmy moment. Jimmy. She's upset? Yeah. She's oh upset. no. Let's just see if we can get to this movie on time, alright? Let's go to San We're about 15 minutes late. Let's see oh, how much of the movie we've missed. This look, this area looks so cool, doesn't it? What? Get a ticket, Lucy Lou. Get a couple for us. Here you go, sweetie. No. Oh. Are you gonna get some popcorn and some? <laughs> That is rude, dude. That is rude. Oh. Two hours later. Jez, I just want a quick review on what you thought of War Room. I'm feeling jacked, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's filled with the Lord. Oh yeah. No, I'm seriously, kidding. I want to hear like a serious review. Like, don't stop mucking around and Sorry. be real. Jesus is pretty cool. Yeah. Really restored that marriage. And I'm still like just thinking like, how can they possibly charge $6.90 for a cup of candy? Like <laughs> we'd gone to Woolies before this. We could have saved at least $8 between us. Back to the movie. Yeah, it was really good. It's good, eh? So where are you going to have your prayer closet? Well, since Mary moved out, there's the bathroom at that end of the house that we don't use anymore. So you could and probably not, just plonk yourself over there, eh? Yeah, and plonk. you know, like, you don't need to be doing anything on the toilet, but it is very much my quiet time, and they are quite comfortable. And, you yeah. know, I'm not meaning to be crude or anything, but, you know, it's a nice place, and it's in the summer it's a lot cooler than the rest of the house. So we'll have to pray into it. Yeah, pray about it, eh? Yeah, we'll, we'll have to find a place to pray before I can pray about it, but, you know, once I do find a place to pray about it, I'll definitely find a place to pray. Chicken, what did you think of the movie? What did you think of the movie, The War Room? I, I think it was a great movie. Uh, probably the best $13 I've spent in a while. Yeah, the best movie I've um, spent in ages. What the yeah, heck? So, whoa, what's, what's going on here, mate? Um, yeah, so I'm actually going home to empty my closet now and just uh, put up some little prayer posters. Um, Get some scripture on the walls. Yeah. Start claiming some victory over the if, sucker. If not, I might just pull the spray cans out uh, and 
just start spraying it, it on the walls. What do you think of the idea of having a prayer caravan and then you can take the caravan wherever you want? Yeah, that is one of the best ideas I've ever heard. Yes. Yeah. Alright, Lissy, what do you reckon? What's your thoughts on the movie The War Room? Oh, I loved it. Yeah? It was awesome. What did you like about it? I loved the heart and soul. Yeah? And the old black lady. Yeah, okay. Lisa? <laughs> He's so racist. I'm, yes, I'm He's African American. <laughs> what and, did you like um, about the black lady? African American. Just loved her passion. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And her advice. Yep. And her boldness, like not being afraid to. Do you reckon that was a wig? <laughs> <laughs> not baldness, boldness. <laughs> oh. And her um. Um. Yeah. Wow, Lissy. <laughs> Why are you distracting me now? You're, you're Everyone's Lissy's like get ripping apart everything that I'm saying. Do you want me to give yeah, you... Yeah, I want to go home and you're going to give me a foot rub and a chocolate <laughs> sundae. <laughs> well, let's, let's stop it right there, guys. And what, um, what do you, where do you think your prayer room is going to be? Yeah, I don't know what? <laughs> what did he say? He said there's not that many rooms to choose from. I know, that's why it's I'm having so a hard cheeky. time thinking. Probably out just on the couch. You go girl, how comfortable. Or outside. <laughs> that's like the prayer lounge room. Yeah. I think I might choose your couch as well. It's quite a nice couch. All right, I'm going to have a quick rant on why I liked so the war room. Oh, no. Oh, did I go the wrong way? Yeah. It's never too late. <laughs> oh. oh, no. Oh. But I'm in oh. park. <laughs> All right, so this is what I thought of the movie War Room. I thought it was an absolute cracker. Why? Because we can sometimes in life just become extremely pathetic prayers. For example, like we might get all jacked up for like Bible study and for church and for like when stuff really hits the fan, but like are in we movies. instead of getting like depressed and worried about silly little things in our lives like are we earning enough money and are we ever going to make it in life? We seriously just need to be getting the knees on the floor. And given that request up to God, and every time you do that, you seem to have like the most refreshing fragrance about life's gonna be all right. You know, like it's not. Is this true? It's very yeah. true. It's <laughs> well spoken. It's very true. Is Aldi still open? <laughs> but honestly, I reckon it was a cracker of a concept, and I think that there should be. I know that there's going to be some serious, like, lifestyle changes from people watching a cracker of a movie like that. Like, mm -hmm. I personally, no, I'm not going to have a prayer closet because I live in a tiny house. <laughs> we take, like, my trips to work. Oh, so I used you to have some have a prayer cracker. House rather than a prayer closet? A prayer what? Prayer house. Yeah, we've got yeah. a prayer house. Prayer house. <coughs> prayer house. Yeah, so. My trips to the, on the way to work, I'm going to be getting some post-it notes. There's going to be some concepts getting thrown up into the atmosphere. Let, let me tell you that much. I'm not even mucking around. That you want to reveal? What? As what to what I'll be that praying you'll be about? Praying for. Well, at the moment, I oh, at the moment just I don't know. <laughs> there's heaps of stuff. Like there's heaps of stuff. Like. I want to be praying constantly over my marriage. I want to be praying constantly over just my relationship with God. I want to be praying over like what I'm doing day to day and whether it's beneficial enough and how I can be getting involved in more people's lives. And there's heaps of stuff that I want to be praying over. So, get it on! Get that sucker up into the air! Yeah, what's it. what's the, the first concept that comes to your head that you want to start <laughs> picking a fight over? In, in prayer, yeah. Oof. It's getting deep, but we need to get deep sometimes. Okay, your mum. You know what you 
she's there. Yeah, she needs. And the way she makes oh, dinner. Yeah. No, I don't know. I think for me, I just need to start praying for a stop. <laughs> That's oh. cool. Yeah, definitely uh, the relationship I have with my mum. That's it's good. definitely up there on the list of need to pray for more. Nice. Mm. I just really want to start praying over everyone that's close to me and that sort of stuff too. So Aww. maybe even my boss as well. Oh, bring it on! I think that it could change the workplace even more. So. Oh, they're not going to pull me over. They never pull me over. I always want to get pulled over and they never get me. Apparently, for our marriage, not that it's like bad, but wow. um, just to pray, just to pray, you know, for us. And especially with the baby coming into the world and oh, yeah. jelly bean. praying for what? A little, a little jelly, jelly bean. bean. It's a little bit bigger than a jelly bean now. Um, like, how big are we talking? Like a gumball? <laughs> like a... Like a pumpkin. Butternut pumpkin. <laughs> Anyways. I think chicken pie <laughs> this. This is getting way out of hand. Oh, Can you just keep it on topic? Like, <laughs> you're really going off topic here. Praying for my baby. And... For my family, my sister and my mom, and that's awesome. Can I just clarify <laughs> on, earlier? Me, I've actually got a really good relationship with my mom. She just, <laughs> I, that. I just himself. didn't want her to cook me dinner that night. You know, I was, I was really looking forward to coming home and cooking up a couple of meat pies and just not having vegetables for once. You know, like she cooks the vegetables. She's, she's not. We're not talking steamed carrot and whatnot. So what we're kind talking of vegetables like, are we talking here? We're talking like full potatoes and sweet potatoes and, you don't and like, like sweet potatoes? and beans. Beans. Alrighty, we definitely 100% agree that you should go and see the movie War Room. It is awesome. It will inspire you. It will encourage you. It's got some great, great storyline and some awesome concepts by an old black lady that you just love to see the character she's got. Go see it, check it out, it's awesome.